Hello everyone, this is Kate Barnes with Scott Leroy Marketing. Today I'm going to go over with you how to edit your digital business card through Blink. Uh, so first thing we're going to do is we're going to go to Blink.me. As soon as we get there, we're going to hit the login button in the top right. Mine is connected to my Google. Otherwise, you're going to go ahead and sign in using your email. If you're signed in through Google like I am, it's going to have you use that and then log in. And it's going to automatically sign in. You won't have to type in your password. Um, so once we're there, we can then edit our card. So we can edit our photo if we have a new one that we'd like to swap out. We can trash this one. And then we can pull in a new one. Um, I don't think I have a new one, but let me just pull my other one back in. Hit save. Um, you can also edit any of the other information that you'd like to on here. If you'd like to change the colors of the icons on the left-hand side, you can do that as well. Um, if you need to edit name, job title, et cetera, all of that can be edited. Um, you'll just click on the field, hit that edit button, and then you can go ahead and um, edit those categories. Same thing, let's say I wanna change this to say my cell phone instead of mobile, I can go ahead and do that. Um, say my website's changed, I can come in here and edit that. If I wanna add any of my social media, I can go ahead and add those as well. So for example, let's pull up YouTube. Let's say I wanna link that one instead. I can go ahead and click YouTube. Then I'm going to pull up Scott Leroy Marketing and grab that URL up at the top. Go ahead and paste that here. And once I have that there, I can go ahead and hit save. And it will go ahead and plug in that information for me here. Um, so you can add any of those fields, add anything that you'd like. If you want to add your Calendly, et cetera, then you can go ahead and hit save. Once you've made all of the changes that you like, you can go ahead and start sharing that, view the QR code. Um, say you want to make a separate card, you can go ahead and do that as well if you want to start all over, um, but not get rid of the other one. Um, hopefully this video was helpful. If you have any questions or any tip videos you'd like to see, uh, feel free to reach out to us at support at scholarymarketing.com. Thank you, and we'll see you next time.